just had an oatmeal cookie. And it was amazing. It had raisins in it. Okay. So. Uh. I still don't know what I need to do. If I had any complaint about this game, it's the, uh, lack of direction. But. See, this is the blacksmith's place, isn't it? No. This is the place with the radio. Maybe. Oh. Fuck yeah. I have taken its magnet out. It could be useful. Oh. Okay. Could I... What can I use the rake on? The only other thing I could think of is the, uh, the rope ladder. That's the only thing I haven't tried. So... I think... It is time... To try that, because I, I don't really have any other... Options here. What's this? Where did this go? This goes back to the cemetery. Shit. I don't need to go back there. I need to go here. Now where's that damn path to the, uh... To the rope ladder? Was it here? I don't remember. It's a bit... No, that's the, um... That's the other thing. Let's go here. Over this path here. This will probably work. I think it was over the uh, bridge, maybe. Possibly. What's this to? I don't remember this either. This is to the bridge, I think. There's a lot of walking. I wish I could sprint faster. All right. Yes, bridge. All right, over the bridge. And to the path on the right is the rope ladder. And I need to go try this. Try this stuff. Good God. So what did you do today? I have done nothing but record this morning. It's fun. Playing video games. Yes. All day. Because I don't have to go to work. Fucking work. Good God. Cleaning up after grown ass people and friggin' cleaning up after myself because of all the blood. Jesus. My cat's meowing too. She wants attention. She usually sits on my lap when I play video games, but um, I do not want her in my room right now because she likes to sit on top of my computer and I don't want her to get in the habit of sitting on this new one. Let's try this. Mother... God damn. Okay. So I just gotta try... everything on everything now. All the time. My cat is going nuts. I need to take care of her. I'll be right back. My cat was trying to shove her ball under my door. Because she wanted me to play fetch with her, so I had to play fetch a little bit. Yes, my cat plays fetch. Misa is very, very strange. She's a very strange kitten. She always has been. Um, I need my lantern. Okay, there's a gate. Oh. This place looks nice. Why, what is this? Is this an outhouse? It is. Oh. I can see something shining at the bottom, but I'm not getting my hands in there. I need something to help me pull it out. Oh, I know what to do. <clears throat> Ugh. It's covered in feces. Put it in your pocket. Awesome. Can I go in here? Can I use this feces key? Again. Good. Oh. Is, 
It has some ashes left. I'll just take them. The hell do I need ashes for? This guy just puts everything in his pockets. I got a shovel. <gasps> Maybe I can dig up a grave. Nah. It's an old oven. It's probably broken. Things are usually broken. What is this? Whoa, Jesus Christ, that's a lot of reading. <clears throat> it all started 30 years ago, when they came to our village. They were a group of foreigners that came from the east claiming to be investors. After some time, strange events began to take place in the village. At first, there were screams and howls at night, followed by long but mild earthquakes. Then some went missing. The police carried out an investigation and didn't find any evidence of criminal activity. They assumed that the missing people left the village on their own. Strange events continued to occur, and soon a rumor spread that the village was cursed. The locals began to abandon the village, and even the mayor left his house and moved to the safety of the city. Only the foreigners didn't appear to be disturbed by those strange events, which seemed odd. So I decided to start watching them. Some nights I saw them cross the bridge and go to the clearing near the rock, and then vanish. One night I was watching them, I slipped and made some noise. They heard it, and one of them began searching. I tried to stay still and quiet. Despite the pain from my twisted ankle, he was getting closer and closer. And suddenly he turned his head and looked straight at me, in my eyes. I prepared myself for a final stand, but he did nothing. He only kept staring at me. I could see his eyes under his cap, looking back at me, full of sadness and despair. He then turned away and told the others that it was only a fox. Whoa. After that, they vanished again into the clearing. I got back to the, to my hidden house. I relieved my confusion by this encounter. Relieved and confused by this encounter. What the hell am I reading? I'm reading a completely different book. I decided to stay hidden in my house for a few days. Five days had passed since that incident. One night, I heard a scream of a woman coming from the abandoned house of the mayor. Not long after, I heard the knock on my door. I hesitated for a while, but finally opened the door. It was a man and a woman. The man seemed to be badly hurt. I told them to come inside, and when the light fell upon the man's face, I recognized that he was the one I had encountered a few days ago. He explained to me that they were being chased by the others. He was one of them, but when the others asked for their unborn child to become the vessel for a dark deity called Typhus, they tried to escape. There was a fight, and he got wounded, but managed to escape with his wife and come here. He told me that he knew I was watching them from for a long time, but he kept it a secret from them. I tried to treat his wound, but it was too late. He already had lost a lot of blood. Knowing he would die soon, he begged me to help find refuge for his wife and his unborn child, and to make sure that the others would never find them, as this would have terrible consequences for the entire world. Soon after, he passed away. I furtively buried his body outside the cemetery so the others wouldn't no, he was dead. Then I took his wife to a monastery far from here. I made sure she would be taken care of and nobody could find her. Up to this day, I've been secretly spying their, act spying their activities. Their leader lives in the abandoned house of the mayor, and they use a secret entrance underneath uh, near the cliffs to gain access to underground cave, which they call Arama. In there, they perform their dark rituals. Their purpose is to prepare ground for the invocation of Typhus. I also learned that there is some sacred item which can disrupt the invocation. After searching for a long time, I managed to find and secure it. I will use it to stop them when the time is right. Oh, jeez. Really? I, did, I could have just read... Huh? <clears throat> Fine. End of book. Alright, so does that mean I could have read the other book? If I think there was a book in another another thing. So I need to go to the cemetery then. I believe I can do this. Can I move this? It might What? Oh. Whoa. Oh So I can come back when I want to. That's good. I was hoping I wouldn't have to use the rake again. Perfect. Wait, I don't even have the rake. 
So that would have been unfortunate if I just dropped down. Good thinking, Vep. Jeez. Okay, cemetery. Now I need to cross that freaking bridge again. This is going to be one hell of a walk. I'm going to drink some Monster. Hmm. Yummy. God damn it. I need to turn the mouse. There we go. Perfect. Perfect orientation. For one handed gaming. Not that this could really be considered a game per se, it's more of a story. Because there's not really much. Not, not a whole lot of play in playing, it's just a lot of walking. That was a new sound. Alright, the cemetery should be on my right, I believe. That's... that's to the theater. And this. My dog's barking too. Jesus Christ, my animals are insane. Cemetery should be over here. Yeah. Yay. Yeah. Awesome. So, it said he was buried outside of the cemetery. Let's try the right side. No? It's just a bunch of rocks. Shit, I have to go back around. Damn it. I don't like the sounds of this cemetery. It's very, very spooky. Is it over here? Over here. Ah! Found it! It's a pile of dirt. Yes it is, friend. Yes it is. And then I have some ash for some odd reason. Oh! Hey! Hi! Must be the man from the journal. Yeah, probably. Let's uh, search his corpse, shall we? He has a key in his pocket. Oh shit, that's a wolf. This is not good. It went away. Uh, so I guess I'm okay. I have to be careful. I'm now permanent crouched. They have that permanently crouched. Jeez. Learn to speak, Fabit. All right, so what is this key to? Found a key. Maybe it's to the mayor's house. I think that's, I mean, besides the town, that's one of the only other places I could think of. So that's to the bridge, and there should be, um, a damn, a big old thing. Oh wait, no, 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 not that way. It would be this way, but then I have to, I have to turn right, because there's the the stairs and stuff. I think. Yes. Probably. Maybe. Uh. Go. Go to where I need you to go, friend. Right? Is this. Was this the way? Don't tell me this wasn't the way. No, that's the way back to the freaking bridge. Shit! I am lost. Turn on my lantern. That's the way to the theater. So it's gotta be over here. Aha! I see it. I think. Maybe. Yep. There it is. Awesome. It's locked. Oh wait, no, this isn't the mayor's house. This won't do. Huh, where was that freaking? Where was that mansion at? I can't remember. Shit. My dog likes to bark at nothing. Does your dog like to bark at nothing? 
She literally just sits on the couch and stares out the window and barks. For no good reason. Okay, yeah, here it is. Uh, is this right? Yes! Yes! What? What was that? I don't know. Are you open? You are open. Awesome. It is very quiet. I will take these blue cutters. Now what? Now nothing. Perfect. So maybe I can go in this house. It's locked. God damn it. Uh can I cut? No, I cannot cut. Okay. So where what where do I gotta do? Cause I need to find another key, obviously. Wait a minute. Can I Oh Ugh. Hello Oh shit <laughs> Uh spooky sounds <sighs> I am a cat burglar. Oh shit. Did I hear somebody? No, this is a toilet with no lid. Everybody likes this tried stuff. Oh. I think I threw it on the roof. Okay. Whoa. That is a demon sitting on top of a woman. And the dark horse is a watching. In here? What this? That's an iron. It's old. Open you, open you, open you, open you. Looks like somebody moved out. There ain't shit no way. Boobies. What? I don't know. But there's a dragon. It's like a really sweet ass dragon. Is there anything? No. Flip. Nope. Whoa. It's like 300. Huh? Oh. Ooh. Cool. There's some serious flickering going on, and I can't tell if it's me or or what if the shadows are just going nuts nothing 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 maybe I'll restart the game and and see if I can't fix it but then again maybe not maybe I don't care that much ooh a lighter fluid dude it didn't make a sound wait a minute nice painting move it can I burn it? No, just just nice painting. Just gotta, you know, admire the paintage. Jesus, this flickering is kind of bothering me now. <laughs> nice painting. Nice throw pillows, friend. Uh, what, what do I do? Bloop! Alright. It's locked. I need to find a way to pick the lock. Oh! How do I do this? This. Ugh. A broom. Give me the broom. No? It's a colander. Eww. Fancy. It's an empty bowl. Yes. Yes, it is. 
I'm so glad you noticed. Ah. <laughs> okay. What about here? Ah, there's a book. Oh, I can't read it. Blast. Book, book, book. Nope, can't read the books. What else can I do? Up in here. Oh. He has no arms. But he is evil. I can tell. Oh, shit. I gotta go back. There's no key. I am seriously confused as to what to do here. Something smells nice in here. In here? Uh, I think you're confused as to where you are, friend. It's mint. Oh. I like mint. Mint is good. It's a pot. Bye, pot. Whoa, I am strong. Hmm. Let's see. Mint. Nope, can't do anything with that. It's gotta be this bicycle, man. Alright. So I took a small break to think about things, and I removed the small metal wire from the bike rim. It seems that the game was a little bit funky, and it didn't want to let me do that. So, uh, now I've got that. And I don't know what to do with it now. Ugh. The walls are all black. Very, very black. And this place is still, um... Rather... Uh, fucked up. Jeez. Ah. Okay. Hey! Fucking good. I missed so much stuff. I'm glad I didn't just give up. Because I was about to. Alright, I think I have an idea of what to do with the wires, even though I could just twist them myself. I might be able to put them in that vise. And then I guess, uh... This I could probably fill with water from the, uh, from the dam, uh, oh, I don't want to go that way, uh, from the dam fountain in the square. Does that make sense? I think it does. Okay, um, blacksmith is over here. I'll do this first. Please let this be right. Please let this be right. Wait, this isn't the blacksmith at all. Where the hell was it? Is it over there? I can't remember. Shit, I guess I will fill the thing. Didn't I have trouble finding the blacksmith last time? I'm gonna have trouble again again. Jeez. You. Hell yeah. Okay. So now to find the blacksmith. This is gonna be the difficult part. Hey, you're still there. Good. I didn't want you to move anyway. Bastard. Okay. Black Smith. Where is the Black Smith? Eight. Ah. Uh, I don't remember. But there was a shed next to it. And it had a horseshoe on the door. So much walking. Maybe it's over here. I think this is it. I am pretty, pretty sure. Yes, it is. Perfect. In a world where Vapid needed a goddamn blacksmith. Let's try this. Maybe it'll make... Okay. Good. Now I can twist it. Oh, genio so. You couldn't just do that with your hands, guy? All right. Now I got to go back to the freaking mayor's house and uh not get lost. 
Too late. Do 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 I got this. Booyah. Retarded.